my brand new white Air Jordans I just bought. That's what you say. Excuse me. Hey, what up? What's the deal? Oh, I'm not nervous. I'm nervous. No, everybody's nervous at all. I was trying to. Somebody had sent me a long, long text message I had to read. So that's all it was. I sent you with. I'm nervous. It's you know what I'm saying? On. I, uh, Tap back into that again another time. Reserve, yes, reserve. I bought your shot class too. Who? Oh. That's the thing you guys got. That's what I was going to do. We get half died. So I got a couple different topics we could discuss. Um, we got some relationships, fatherhood. Everybody father, right? No. Can you get No, I ain't got no kids in me. No. No, I really don't have okay. no kids. <laughs> what do you think about fatherhood? Oh no, I'm trying. You trying? Yeah, okay. one day I'm trying. Um, what's that one? She, she know what she is. She know what she is. Do you know what she is? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't just have a kid with anybody. Nah, this this my little this my little sweet mom. Oh, okay. <laughs> my little sweet. My little sweet. Yeah, yeah. My little sweet. So what y'all want to talk about? Relationships, fatherhood. We got mental health. Let's talk about those standards. Mm -hmm. Damn boy. Those standards. Y'all with that? Yeah. Good, good. For sure. So a lot of people play into that. Oh God. So I had a conversation the other day and I got ridiculed for having a double standard. And in my offense, I feel like when it comes to men and women, we aren't the same when it comes to certain standards, right? Correct. Mm -hmm. So let's say like your girl go out in the middle of the night to the store or something. Mm -hmm. You're like, no, nah, let me go with you. Mm -hmm. Or who you going with or whatever, you're not there. But for us, we can get up and go to the store the other night, and it ain't no problem because I'm a grown ass man, right? Yeah. yeah. So I was trying to explain it to somebody, and they didn't understand. So like, what y'all what y'all take on certain double standards or like stuff you feel like should be a double standard for people? Let me let me let me speak on that one. So I would say from that standpoint, like if a woman go out. First and foremost, I feel like men are protectors by nature, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So if a woman goes out and, you know, probably run to Walmart, you know, do whatever they got to do, a man, like, and they have a man, the man's going to feel like he needs to protect. And that's probably the difference between why a woman wouldn't understand why, why can you go out and do your thing, but I can't as a woman. Because they don't have that protective instinct that I think men have from birth. Mm -hmm. Damn near because if you think about it, men are like providers, protectors, and you know that type of stuff is like in our DNA. So mm -hmm. that's where the women feel like they can't, you know, get a agree with that because they feel like they can do just the same. In which they can. It's just as a man, you just you know what I'm saying. That's just part of who you are. That's what I feel. I'm right with that. Facts, like, cause you can you can jump on that a, a bunch of different type of ways. Like, not even just saying that. Like, but you saying a bunch of different uh, double standards and stuff. Like, far as like strength and stuff goes. So you know, the times we live in now, we talk about sports and stuff like that. Like, it should be a double standard. Yeah. You know, what I'm saying like, females shouldn't have to compete in sports and certain stuff when it comes to men because by nature. We are physically built differently. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Not to downplay any woman that work. It's women out here to go to the gym more than I do all day long. You probably all the way strong with me. We get on that field, I'm gonna run through you still. Just I'm just built differently. Like right? it's just in my DNA. You know what I'm saying? Not to downplay you or not, but it's just you 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 in a difference I believe. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? They were talking about Serena Williams a while ago, um, and people was like trying to compare her to other male tennis players and stuff because she's considered the best tennis player to ever do it and she kept it on and she was like well if i play male tennis players it's a whole different ball game she said out of her own mouth you know what i'm saying because she knows like you know what i'm saying but as far as a female realm go she dogging yeah. you know what i'm saying and she's played yes. matches with some of uh, some some other males and stuff like that and she lost you know what i'm saying it's like it's okay you're a male it's you know it's a whole different ball game you know what I'm saying? So like, it's a bunch of different standards. I, it's supposed to be a bunch of different standards when it comes to double standard because it's a male, it's a female. You know what I'm saying? That's why I look at it like that. Like, it's supposed to be like not to downplay a female or for a female to downplay us or whatever. Like one Every, and one. And everybody one. It's has roles. gender roles. I'll just say, and a lot of people don't want to say like, oh, you you gender role. Oh, like I'm not, but at the same time, I guess I am. You know what I'm saying? Because I expect my female to do certain things. She's going to expect me to do certain things. Of course. You know what I'm saying? So, like, in all actuality, it's supposed to be that way. Yeah. You know it's just hit it in the butt. LeBron James wake up tomorrow and want to say I identify as a 
female, he's gonna score <laughs> a thousand points a game in the WNBA. Yeah, it's a whole different ball game. It's a whole different ball game. So you yeah. can speak on that as an army, as an army man. You know what I'm saying? How they integrating females into the uh, infantry world? Yeah. <clears throat> you want to speak on that? No. Nah. Next time. <laughs> <laughs> Do y'all feel like there's double standards when it comes to being in relationships? Yeah. Speak on it. Shit, this is, it's, it used to be a man's world, now it's a woman's and a man's world. Women do what the fuck they want. I can cuss on them. Yeah, go ahead. Women do what the fuck they want to do. And then get mad when we speak on it. So, so you feel like... You ain't not here holding the door for a man. <laughs> So you feel like we don't have a, that never was a thing though. We don't have traditional women in the same. That's very sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Traditional women. You don't women. have the women that you got when your grandma was small yeah. that don't that don't fly no more. That's a big facts. You come yeah. home even you come home late, you still got a little dinner plate. Yeah, your your, your grandma something. would have fixed your granddad a plate. Feel me? These women ain't doing that. Well, no wasn't nothing to be talking about. Yeah. Granddad just sit down, cut the TV on. She come around the corner, here you go. Yeah. You feel me? It ain't no question, but I, I ain't got to ask if we eat for them. Yeah. It's, already, it's already set in stone, you feel me? Yeah. You think that's the way the world is? Like, the way the world has kind of evolved to? Because yeah. women nowadays, they feel like, you know what I'm saying, this ain't 1940. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to do my due diligence within the household, but I'm not, you know what I'm saying? I guess the way it was kind of brought up when we was, I guess, younger and then times before with our grandparents and stuff like that. The man went out and got the bread. Women stayed at home, took care of the house and the kids. Mm -hmm. Nowadays, it's like women then caught up. Like, I ain't got to stay home and watch the kids. You know what I'm saying? Everything is kind of like an equal opportunity type of thing. Like, I ain't got to stay home and watch the kids. Like, we both can go get the bread. We both can take care of the kids. We both can take care of the house type of deal. And that's their, that's women's, in a sense, mentality nowadays, which is... I mean, it's cool, but it still rolls within the house that you got to play. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what right. I feel. So what you think, like, the cause of, like, all... Social um, media. <laughs> music. Yeah. All, men. The, all the single ladies. I'm going to say men. So when you say men... I'm going to say that for, for like this because um, people say, like, oh, uh, you know, pussy born the world, whatever, like that. Yes and no. Right? You said pussy run the world? Yeah, a lot of people hear this say shit, 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 shit like that. You know what I'm saying? And um, I get where females say that I'm asking because of female type shit. You know what I'm saying? A female can graduate high school. Well, don't even graduate high school. Like, fuck that. I'm going to go get this OF going. I'm going to go hit this pole. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get my body done and, and make bank. and get banked. You Super feel me? Bank. But if men Dude, get bank. back to the way that we like, we don't want none of that shit. Mm -hmm. A lot of females are going to be hurt. They're going to be hurt. If we all sit back and be like, no way, I ain't watching no more porn. You know what it is? I ain't yeah. watching no more none of this. I ain't going to no more strip clubs. We're I ain't not gonna, doing that. I'm not, a, not I know, I know. It's not going to happen. <laughs> motherfuckers, it's too. I, this, I ain't, I ain't saying I'm going to stop. You know what I'm saying? Cause I, you know what I'm saying? I, occasionally, I might throw a little something, something in the club. But I'm just saying, though, like, if hypothetically speaking, if, if all men were just like, we ain't on none of that whole oh, shit no more, I'm only looking for classy women that's doing something with they self and wooty 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 woo I want a lady in the street, freaking the sheets type woman, you feel me? Anything outside of that, I ain't rocking with none of that. A lot of females gonna be hurt. They're gonna have to revert back to okay, let me get my shit together. But what if they don't know it's really revert back. They're gonna be hurt. It's really them, what it is. Hurt. It's they really hurt. It's really the revenge of the nerds type of world out here right now because real niggas need to just take the platform that we once had and, and, and demand these type of things. Not demand, I don't want to use the word demand, but kind of like, like emphasize towards on what kind of women we want or whatever the case may be. Because at the end of the day, it's these lame cats, quote unquote lame, whatever you want to call them. You know what I'm saying? They might, they might get a little education behind them. Then they, then they get on top of the playing field. They got some bread in their pocket and all the chicks want is the bread. Yeah. They don't care. If you the lamest cat on earth, and you can grab me a little Birkin bag or some red bottles, and seven, she gonna let you, and, seven, and she gonna let you spank. About seventy five percent. She gonna let you spank. Yeah. If okay. You, if you how much money you got when it's all said and done? A real, a real nigga gonna spank you. If you're not a real nigga with money, you spending money like that. 
Your, yeah. your, your, your chick gonna get hit. Yeah. Papoose? Maybe Ma just got knocked off. Y'all ain't see that? Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> what? Uh-huh. Oh, y'all ain't watched it. Oh, Ricky Marsh got it. It's, 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 it's plain day. She was at the battle rap and and uh, um what's his cousin's name? Uh forgot his name. He just he was he was rapping against the nigga that smacked her and she's standing on the sidelines. She's standing up with the stone cold face. They ain't even had a battle in New York and he said everything. Oh yeah, he went crazy on her. Went crazy on her. She just standing up with the stone cold face like. But supposedly the, the I ain't see the fight, but supposedly Papu's dog, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Hit him with the one two, whatever feeling. But he let all that be known. Like that's why we in New York right now, cause now we on his playing field where he from. Oh yeah, yeah, she got knocked off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's crazy. Yeah, yeah. So what do you think? Like women being the way they are now does for dating and finding an actual wife? Man, you gotta lock Ooh. in. You gotta lock in when you find it. Look, man, words are my homeboy. The great swim. When you get to <laughs> our duty station, when you find a locker in, I'm telling you, I was in Fort Hood because he know how we get down. Mm-hmm. TWB, man, you know, you know. Yes, sir. Yes, My sir. homeboy told me, when you get here, it ain't that many. It's about 17 to 1. When you find that right one, lock in. And I ain't believe it, them true facts. It's about, yeah, yeah, yeah. But that makes it like that, that ratio is a hundred times more difficult yeah, to find. Well, what I mean, given, 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 given the situation that, you know what I'm saying, I would say that single guys are in right now, mm. being stationed in Alaska, is is chances are you find it, you know what I'm saying, the love of your life yeah, out here is, 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 is I got lucky, pickings. bro. I got lucky. I got it lucky, too. It, it ain't going to be... You know what I'm saying? Not necessarily saying you gotta go to a city to find a you know what I'm saying, somebody, but like out here, if if you doing just in general, just say you, you, you just go to work, go to the store, whatever, go grocery shopping, whatever, and you go out to these little bars and what Fairbanks so small, you it's gonna be rare, you might have to wait till PCS season to see something different. Yeah. You ain't gonna see nothing on farm. Yeah. So yeah. Or, let me ask you, let me, let me just, for the room, I mean, because, you know, we just have a conversation. Like, do you think, you know what I'm saying, standards may hold you back from finding something? Like, like what's in the Alaska problem in general? What's, in general, what, in yeah. general. Because Alaska, like I said, Alaska, uh, you ain't going to really be I, on I, shit. I'm going to have a miniature disagree with you, right? I feel like you should never, as a man, uh-huh. as a man, right? And, but we do this all the time. Females don't do this, but we drop our standards all the time for a female. Females don't drop their standards for us. They don't. Right? A man will date down. Females won't date down. You feel me? Well, Why do you think that is? Hold on, hold on. What you guys said? A man will date down. A female won't date down. You know what I'm saying? So, like, we a date a female that's like, oh, she cute or whatever, but she not even... A smidget of Smith, why you up? What we got going on in life, you feel me? <laughs> yeah. But we accept that though. But it, it, it's rare that it's opposite. I mean, I don't, you'll I don't. find them. You'll find the little gems of females that be like, "Well, yeah, I know he don't got a lot going on. He don't got this. He don't got that going on." But them be them damaged ones sometimes. Not, not saying all females, but majority of the time it be it be the damaged ones that are that are date down versus date up. You know what I'm saying? They're just a the nature of the beast. So you you say we we drop our stairs and we date down. Like why is it like that? Why do you think it's like that? Because we are back to what the bro was saying. We are used to being the providers. We are used to being the protectors. So in our mind, it's like okay, you have certain qualities that I want from you. Mm-hmm. You don't have certain financial shit that I got that I want from you. You don't have certain other shit I want. Because for a man, when it comes to a woman, it's simple shit. Like,